Hi, so I wanted to make a quick video. I figured it would be easier than typing out an explanation for how you can add collections on Shopify. So in products, you're going to just go to collections and create a collection. And um, before I create a collection, let me see what I already have in my Trinzy collection so I can just transfer it over. Um, mama, mama. let's make a keychain collection. I don't think I have a keychain collection. So let's do keychains. And then um, you can write a description. I'll do that later when I have more time. Um, so for this, I'm just going to put keychains. So that anytime I put keychains as a tag, it's automatically uploaded into this collection and I don't have to look for it. Um, and I'll put an image later as well. And we'll just save it. I already have some keychains on my website, so it should populate the ones that I do have. Um, and then for Trinzy, when, let's see, I shouldn't have made a keychain collection, I just realized. But it's okay. Um, let's go to accessories. Okay, there's no new keychains, but there are new hats um, and shoes and stuff. So for the sake of this, let's make it fast. You're going to click on, if I wanted to add everything on this page, I would click on add to collections. And then... Um, make it accessories and it should pop up right here with the star and you're just going to press ok it'll import everything into that collection and let's say i wanted to add um not everything on the page so hide this please um <laughs> so if i wanted to just add these sunglasses um, to a collection, I would put add to collections and it's going to go automatically to the last collection that you added something to. So if I wanted to create a new collection, I could, or if I wanted to keep it in this collection or add it to maybe this one, I could switch it. Um, it'll just go to whatever collection has the star. So um, anyway, to import those to Shopify, we just go to collections which is under this um icon of the little person <clears throat> and then we select the one that we want to add i want to add hats today so it'll show you which ones are already in your shopify store um and it's not going to re-add them just but you can remove them if you don't want to see those. And then whenever you're set, you're going to press add, add to Shopify, put whatever tag describes this collection. Um, if it was, if I had it more um, detailed, I would have like fedoras in one. So I could do all the tags for fedoras and then beanies in one and do all the tags for beanies. But for today, we're just going to put hats. And I'll put accessories because I have an accessories collection that I want this to go into as well. I believe both of mine are automated, but you can check what collection um, you want it to go for. So if it's grayed out, that means it's an automated collection. So it'll be based on what you have in your tags. And then if it is something you can add stuff to, it'll have it'll be in black for you to click. And hats is after. Yeah, so my hat collection is already an automated collection, so I don't have to worry about that. And for this, I'll put hats. Um, you could check and change the prices to what you want it to be. So whatever you set your markup to be, it'll automatically do that markup. And then um, for me, I like to I like my prices to look a certain way. So um, like this one that has. Four forty three ninety nine. 99 I don't know. I don't like that price point. So I might make it lower or higher and make it forty nine ninety nine, just so it's a 
better number in my mind or 40.99 i really don't like that price point at all so i might make it 49.99 or if i wanted to add in shipping i could add in shipping here i could make everything five dollars more just for the sake of shipping um or 10 or however much you want anyway once you're done you can add it to shopify and it'll automatically populate in your shopify store um, it might take some time depending on, you know, how fast your Wi-Fi is, but they'll email you when it's uploaded most of the time. Um, and yeah, that's it. You can also still change the price in your Shopify. So if I wanted to go ahead and add these without changing all the prices in this video, you see the timer, it's adding 69 hats to my store. And then when I go to my hat collection, um, I should start seeing them populate. So right now I only have nine in my collection, so it's gonna slowly start adding that. See, that's one of the hats that we saw in the picture. So it's adding the hats. <laughs> and if you wanna check, just press refresh and it you should see some additional hats. Oh, it's still at nine. Well, it's still loading. <laughs> 